One year and one day after he was elected, Ottawa Mayor Jim Watson revealed the 2012 draft budget at City Hall. Watson stressed that property taxes would go up less than 2.5%. That's the lowest it's been in five years. We deliver this modest tax plan while continuing to make the ambitious changes we need to strengthen our finances, assets, and services. Somerset Ward Councillor Diane Holmes says the new budget will disperse the money evenly throughout the city. It's not the kind of budget we've had in the past where there are major cuts proposed, like the year when all the cultural funding was going. So I don't think we'll see too many people too upset about this budget. Not everyone agrees. And I know a lot of other people will say, like, you know, they're watching for their bus and it comes by and just goes right by them because it's full. I think there should definitely be more money spent on um, environmental things. Ian Lee, a Carleton business professor, is concerned about the budget's long-term effects. So I applaud him in the sense of keeping it down to 2.3%. 2, 2 At the same time, I think that there are some uh, ticking time bombs in the budget that could blow up because they're long-term commitments. LRT, if it comes in above $2 billion, and Mayor Watson's in deep trouble. Regardless of what the budget promises now, it will be debated and reworked over the next few weeks by council and the public. The city hopes to approve the budget on November 30th. Marika Large, CJTV News, Ottawa.